Hello everyone, this is Prashant Dalwani from IndianZone.com. So today we'll be talking about BITSAT 2017. The application form for this examination is already available and candidates can fill the same up to 6th of March 2017. Video regarding how to fill the application form is already available on our YouTube channel that is IndianZone. Candidates can subscribe to the channel and see various other videos regarding many other engineering examination as well. Today we'll be talking about various questions that candidates have who fill the application form for BITSAT. So we'll be discussing about them in detail. So starting with the first question that is, do we have to send the application form by email or post? No, the candidates do not have to send the application form through e email or post. All they have to do is go to the online website and fill the application form there itself. They'll have to make the payments online or they can do through ICICI bank channel. Apart from that, there are some other questions regarding the qualifying examination. Candidates who have taken physics, chemistry or biology in their 10 plus 2, can they give the examination? Yes, they are eligible to take BITSAT 2017, but all they can apply for is the B Pharma program that the BITS Pilani University offers. Candidates who have appeared for the qualifying examination in 2016, can they give the examination? Yes. The candidates who have passed the qualifying examination in 2016 or are appearing in the same in 2017 are eligible to give the examination. No one before that. Candidates who have scored less than 75% in the qualifying examination in 2016 and are appearing for the same again in 2017, are they eligible to give the examination? Yes, they can, but they'll have to keep in mind that they will have to give all the examinations that are required apart from the qualifying examinations. Yes, if someone has apart from the qualifying examination, yes, if someone has made some mistakes while filling the application form for BITSAT, can they make corrections? Yes, they can make corrections. There will be specified dates that is 7th of March to 10th of March. In between these dates, you'll have to make the corrections and you'll have to pay the required fees. Last year it was 400, this year it hasn't been announced yet. So based on that, you will have to make corrections in your application form in this specified time. These are some of the basic questions regarding how to fill the application form and other admission details. So that's it from Intrend Zone. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can visit www.intrendzone.com for any details regarding engineering examination, including various other examinations such as J-Main, Bitsat, etc. Thank you for watching.